straight in LA. Gonna find it stay straight. Seems that everybody is gay. Hello, hello, hello. This article was taken from the Daily Mail. So good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Welcome to the mental house. You know, I always tell young people, there's nothing, and I mean nothing, nada, that is new under the sun. Everything that you think you're doing, it's done been done before. All y'all think that you're getting over on your parents and they don't know what you're doing. Trust me, they done probably did that and a whole lot more. And they know you're lying. They just watching you and they going, Lord have mercy. My child is just such a liar. My child think I believe this bull crap. But, <laughs> serious. This is interesting because a lot of people think that electric cars are new. And I got this, again, this article is from the Daily Mail, and the pictures are there. They are very obvious. Um, there's an incredible photo, and it shows a woman charging her electric car 112 years ago. Can y'all believe what I said? 112 years ago. <coughs> Looking at the high-tech electric cars like Tesla, it can be easily believed that electric vehicles are recent invention. Yet these photos reveal the history of the electric car stretches far back longer than we might ever even imagine. The photos were snapped way back in 1922 and shows a woman dressed in a large hat and glove posing in a garage with an electric car. I'll be dipped in dog doodle. -doo. The car in the photos is a Columbia Electric Victoria Phaeton, a type of electric vehicle first produced in 1905. Bought new, a car like this would have cost $1,600 in 1908 or around $45,000 in modern term time. Dang. Someone plugging in the electric car to charge might seem like a typical scene from a modern life. But these photos are anything but modern and were actually taken 112 years ago. I want y'all to go look at that because right now I'm not uh, uh, equipped to share the screen. So it is incredible. Doom buggies, all kinds of crazy looking cars uh, being launched as electric the car in the photo is a columbia again victoria phaeton the type of electric vehicle first produced in 1905 so the history of the electric car goes as follows in 1890 william morrison a chemist from iowa creates the first electric car 1900 electric vehicles account for a third of american car sales um I'm pretty sure that some black guy, uh, you know, restored this and it was just taken from him and giving it to somebody. Anyway, um, 1909, Oliver P. Fritchell creates a car which he claimed can travel 100 miles on a single charge. <laughs> and in 1910, charges were widely available through in people's homes and garages. In 1912, production for electric cars peaks as electric uh, mo automobile starter is invented, leading to a decline in popularity. Wow. 1935, electric cars have all but disappeared from the road. That was in 1935. And they production peaked again in 1912. Ain't that something? It boasted 24 battery cells, the three forward gears, as well as two in reverse, and could reach top speeds of up to 15 miles an hour. However, driving this would be nothing like 
any modern car. Unlike many cars of this period, it still had a carriage design, you know, a carriage-based design. So without a steering wheel or accelerator pedal, the speed was controlled by a stick held in the left hand. Meanwhile, the driver would steer the car like a boat using a tiller. Hey, but it was still electric. The brakes were then split over two pedals with one meant for parking and the other meant for slowing down. <laughs> what you got to say? It might look quite different to a modern version, but this is actually the car's first changing station. I mean, <laughs> y'all got to check the article out. It's pretty funny. Uh, it's in the Daily Mail, and it shows you the very first... Um, Electric car, I never knew. I never knew. <laughs> All right. What about you? Anyway, wait a minute. Hold on. Vehicles, of course, were the vehicle of choice for the rich and were vastly, vastly popular and widespread. That is incredible. The electric core. Mm-mm-mm. And there's another one that said they had a 100-mile French electric is guaranteed to travel 100 miles to a single on a single charge over city streets or country roads. I don't know. No steering wheel. It looks weird. What y'all think? <laughs> it's just crazy. How did you know this? Because I didn't. I really didn't even know. All right, leave your comments below and tell me what you think.